What is up, everybody? Here is my review on my sample box. Okay, uh, at the bottom of the totem pole, we have the liquid and we have Seduce Juice. Um, I'm going to have to go with Dead Last being the Dharma. Uh, that's by Seduce Juice. Um, it was, by no means were any of these bad. Let me start that off. None of these were bad. Uh, I was uh, really pretty darn happy with everything. But if I'm having to scale it on a 1 to 5, which I have 5 liquids here, I'm going to go with Dharma as the bottom of the list. Uh, Dharma is supposed to be a Thai tea. I love Thai tea. I wasn't really getting it. Uh, it almost, until I read the flavor description, it almost had that Asian tobacco slight. There was a lot of cream in there, so I thought it was an Asian tobacco with a lot of cream and a little something else would give me that kind of greeny, earthy taste. Um, so that being said, uh, that's why Dharma is on the bottom of the list because it is supposed to be a Thai tea. They describe it as spot on. Um, I liked it, but it wasn't a Thai tea. Second on the list, I'm going to go with Niquid Strawberry. Now, this is my first time tasting Niquid, and uh, everything I heard about them is pretty true. They do a lot of single flavors. They do like strawberry, pear, grape, blah, 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 so on and so on. From what I've heard about them, their single flavors are like dead on. And sure enough, this is just a good dead on strawberry. It's nothing fantastic. It's nothing great. It's just a really good dead on strawberry. Um, I think I got in my last box, I want to say in my last box, I had another strawberry. Now that was a really good strawberry. It was dead on. It was just fantastic. This is just a good basic strawberry. Um, if you're getting someone that's starting, I, I would say if you're getting someone starting vaping, trying to quit cigarettes, I would highly recommend liquid because the flavors are pretty straightforward. They're, they're nothing, uh, that you're going to have to guess at undertones and all that other stuff pretty straightforward I liked it now uh, I was very happy to get the seduced juice I was very happy to get liquid both of these juices I hadn't tried I uh, just got back from vape summit and unfortunately I didn't get to try a lot of stuff while I was there so we're moving on to our first second and third uh, I'm sorry about writing on the box I had a card but somebody threw it away before I got to make the video so, that being said, we had Nick's Blissful Brews. That is my third choice. Um, never heard of this guy before. Never had. This is their apple cider. I was really impressed with this. Uh, it's a really good apple cider. And, you know, like today was a good day to vape on it because it temperature went from like 72 to like 45 today ridiculous it's freezing outside um this is really good it's a little mm, straightforward apple at first but then you start to get the cinnamon and other fall flavors kick in and the more you vape this the sweeter it gets so it's a little not standoffish but kind of i hate to use the word bland but the more when you first start va vaping it it's not as sweet until you get about a good three or four inhales in. And then the other thing too I liked was the flavor doesn't really stick with you. There's not a lot of aftertaste going on, uh, which you usually get with a lot of these uh, spices and, and clove and all that, you know. So I was really happy with it. Well done, guys. Uh, Nick's Blissful Brew Apple Cider, my third placement for the box. Second, Omega Vapes. Uh, this is my second bottle from Omega Vape in my sample box, and uh, I gotta say, pretty happy with it. Uh, it's a really good flavor. This is a, um, what was this one? I know what you are. I forgot what you are. I forgot what this is. I'm sorry, guys, but it was delicious. This is the Breeze. Uh, really good. What I'm liking most about Omega Vapes is they're very cloudy, very nice and cloudy. Uh, it had a good, clean flavor, nothing overpowering, just, you know, a nice medium punch, nothing really strong, nothing in your face. 
a lot of cloud, a lot of vape, just a good, clean, solid vape. I'd highly recommend it. That is my number two choice. Number three, this was a surprise for me. This was a, another brand never heard of, took me by total surprise. Uh, honestly, I've been vaping this all day long. And um, this, I don't know, it's either... Uh, it's either Kingston Kings or Azaria. I think it's Azaria Kingston Kings is the flavor. I want to say that's right. Azaria and Kingston Kings is the flavor. This is, and until I read their flavor description, I had no idea. This is a Melon Dew soda. Yep, that's what I said. Now, I don't really get that soda taste, but it's a, it's a really good citrusy um it almost tastes kind of like guanaba which is this mexican fruit that uh i think i've used it to describe it somewhere else before it's a cross in between like guava pineapple and oh pear i don't know something like that that's the easiest flavor description i can give you now that i read it as a honeydew soda I can kind of see where I was getting that flavor description without knowing what it was. I like to vape all my stuff before I read the flavor descriptions. Uh, with Nick Witt, I mean, it was pretty straightforward. That was a strawberry. With Nick's Blissful Brew, it was an apple cider. So I knew what I was getting into. But the rest of these, I really didn't. And I like to vape that way. That way, I'm not searching for those flavors. I'm just enjoying it for what it is. Uh, taste is subjective, people. Uh, I'm, I'm not saying this does not taste like a melon dew. Now that I know that it's a melon dew, I can see where they're getting it from. Uh, the other thing you got to remember is all these concentrates that they're making stuff from, there's no telling. I mean, they could be getting, they could be doing straight extracts for all I know. But that is my number one choice. Now, what I, the other thing I loved about this, it was a nice, clean vape. Um, nothing, again, nothing really strong, nothing in your face. Very nice, clean mild this would be a fantastic summer vape um really cloudy i was really impressed with this uh i know it's hard to tell because the frame rate on this phone is not the best but i mean it's really thick it's not like motor oil like uh mike's was in the last box that i got but it is really good guys i do recommend it it was a surprise in the box for me uh and i've vaped everything so for me really impressed with it uh man this is my second month's box i've been 100 percent happy with both boxes i'm going to keep it for a third and ride this out who knows how long i'll keep this so those are my reviews uh let me know what y'all think any questions, I'll be more than happy to answer. Uh, I'm, I get my other box in another four weeks. So uh, look, look forward to next month. And I hope everyone enjoyed the video. Y'all vape safe and keep vaping. All right, guys. Later.